Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hope everyone is having a wonderful, blessed day. So I have an extra large, amazing Dollar Tree haul for you guys. So this is gonna be part one of two because I have four large bags filled to the brim and I'm gonna do two bags per video. So today will be part one, tomorrow will be part two, so stay tuned for tomorrow's, which is gonna be amazing. Um, but yeah, so grab a drink, get a snack, this might be a little while. Um, so yeah, if you love Dollar Tree, please consider um, subscribing and hitting that notification bell because I do a lot of Dollar Tree hauls. If you love Timu, I do a lot of Timu, a lot of Shein, I do reviews. So if that's the kind of thing that you like, please consider subscribing and let's begin. So first I do want to show you some art from Malachi. He made this pumpkin. I thought it was so cute. And then he made this pumpkin, and my husband says these are so cute that we should frame them. So I'm thinking of framing them and then saving them each year as like our Halloween decor. Because look at that, that is so cute. And he even says Malachi on there. And yeah, so I just wanted to show you two little art pieces that Mr. Malachi made for us. He's so crafty. Um, okay, so first I grabbed another one of these because I needed another one. I filled all three of the other ones that I got with all my nail supplies, and I needed another one. So it's just one of these large containers. It has a handle, and then the two little snaps on the sides. Um, I picked out the green again, so they all match. I'm just one of those that I like to match everything. So I grabbed one of these for um, my nail supplies. Okay, let's jump in. So, this is mail. So, I got four of these. These are so good. I absolutely love these. These are the Butterball Smoked Turkey Snack Sticks. 70 calories per serving, and they are so good. These are the only kind that I really like. So, I grabbed four of them for mama because they are so good so I grabbed those and then of course while I was there I did grab two things of toilet paper just to have on hand um, in our stockpile of toilet paper always need toilet paper right so I got those and then look at these guys I got one for me one for Elizabeth these are towel scrunchies. They were selling some, one individually. This is a pack of two. Absorbs water after shower. And I mean, come on now. It is leopard print. So I grabbed one for me and one for Elizabeth. I'm gonna put Elizabeth to the side and I'll open up mine and show you. Ooh, these are so soft. Of course, I get it because of the leopard prints. And they're like, you can wear them as regular scrunchies as well if you want. But it says it's good for after the shower. And then this like creamish tan looking color. And they are so soft. Absolutely adorable. So I grabbed those. And that, that one is for me. And then this one is for Elizabeth. <coughs> And then look what I found for Malachi. I have two other ones that are different in the next haul, so stay tuned for that. But this is the three in one shampoo, conditioner, and body wash. And it's Blimpy. Malachi has been loving Blimpy, and this spins, and I thought that was so cute. And it is the mixed berry scent. This is 14 fluid ounces. And let's see. Ooh, it smells good. Yeah, so he, we are going to be using this for him. I'm probably gonna save this for Christmas time um, as a little Christmas gift for him. So I thought that was pretty cool. Name brand and it's Blimpy. He's been loving Blimpy lately. So got that. And then I got two Christmas little item decor pieces. 
This is a little candle holder and I thought it was so cute. It's very sparkly and it has like that winter scenery look to it uh, with the snowflakes and I'm going to put it up here on my desk. And I thought that was so cute. And I'm going to put one of those LED candles in here. Not a real one, but an LED candle. And that's going to look so pretty at nighttime in the evening. So I grabbed that. And then to go along with it, I saw this one. And this is just called... What is this called? It doesn't really say what it's called. But it's another little, like, jar. And it has the burlap on it. And then it has a snowflake. They had Christmas trees and something else, I believe. But I picked out the snowflake. And I thought these were so cute together. And this one, they had the red and blue, I believe, and silver. But I chose the green. So I thought these were so cute. And, of course, I'm going to put tea lights, the LED tea lights in here. So I thought those were so cute. Yes, please. And that goes along with my snowman snowflake theme. All right, let's see. I picked up some more of these yard steak things, these solar steak lights. I got one in red and one in green. Make sure you always have these little um, steak things because sometimes they don't. And I'm gonna put these in my flower pots. I haven't pulled the tabs yet, so they're still good. And these are gonna go in my flower pots outside. I can do that. I mean, I think I'm still going to, I'm going to be a rebel. A lot of our neighbors are going to be rebels and we're still going to decorate our porches. We don't care whether they're going to kick us out because we decorated our porches. I mean, come on now, you know. So, got those. And then to go along with that, with my snowman theme, I got the snowman. So, I thought this was so cute. And, of course, it has this right here. So these two are going to go in one flower pot. This one's going to go in another right next to each other to go with my snowman theme. So I thought that was really, really cute. And then, guys, I found pillowcases from Dollar Tree. Pillowcase covers from Dollar Tree. And this is by the Seasonal Goods Christmas House. And these are 15, almost 16 by 16, so I will need to get some pillows that are that size. But I thought these were so cute. Let's see. Oh my gosh, these will definitely go along with the other two pillows that I got from um, Timu. This says, fresh cut Christmas trees, pine, spruce, fir. And I think they had these last year and I didn't get them and I wish I did. It has the zipper on the bottom and it's kind of like that burlap feel. And yeah, so I can't wait for that. So I got that one. Let me fold it up. I don't know how they had it. So I can put it away. And then this one, there was like three different ones. And then this one says candy canes, cookies, cocoa, and confec confections. Confections. I thought that was so cute. So to have these two together, um, or like one of these with, um, what am I trying to say? Have one of each of these with the ones that I got from Timu right next to each other. That would be really cute on our couch. So I got those two, so cute, really good quality. So got those, yes, I'm still kind of stuffed up. Let me fold these and put them away. And I found two new scrunchies right here. And what's cool about these ones is these ones have large and small pearls on them and I thought they were so cute there you go they're fuzzy and really soft and have the pearls and I absolutely love that it's gonna look really pretty in the hair like that so I got the black one and then I got this uh, tannish grayish one right there 
So cute. These would be cute for stocking stuffers or basket fillers for Christmas. So got those. And then I saw these from Malachi. I found another size of these Planet Box stainless steel. This is a square dipper. Leak proof container for dips and sauces and is 1.8 ounce. And I got two of them, perfect for when I sent him with his chicken nuggets. I could put ketchup in here. And this is what they look like. So that has the little silicone top. You open it up, you put your dip in, and then you seal it back up. And it's good to go. So I picked out two of those for Malachi's lunches. Two of those. So that is for Mr. Malachi. And then I got these um, by Christmas House Jingle Gift Tags. You get six of them in here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, so I thought these would be perfect for like the teacher's gifts to add to their bags. And this is what they look like. They have jingles on them, jingle bells. And then one says, may your holidays be sweet. There's a Christmas tree a gingerbread, a gingerbread house, a coffee cup that says have a cup of cheer, and then a, a cooking apron that says official cookie tester. And I thought these were so cute, so I grabbed a pack, um, two packs to add to the teacher's gifts on their gift bags. Those bags that I got from um, Timu, I'll add these on there. And I thought they were so cute, very cute with the little jingle bells. So I got those. And then, is everything else beauty related? Yes. So everything else is beauty related and this is the jackpot that I hit. So I found there was a total of three eyeshadow palettes but I only picked two out of the three. These are by Beauty Intuition eyeshadow palettes and this is what they look like. Uh, yes, please. I can't wait to try these out. So I'm going to open this one up. This one is the Rosy Nudes. And it says long lasting and smooth application. Alright, so that's what it looks like. Yeah, those look like really pretty summer colors. I can't wait to try those out. So I got that. And then this one is the Moody Neutrals. And the other one were like bright colors with like greens and blues and stuff, but I really don't wear those that, that often. And Elizabeth doesn't either, so I didn't get that. So here's the Moody Neutrals, and the, this would be perfect for like the fall and winter time. So I'll show you the difference. So this is the Rosy Nudes and the Moody Neutrals. Very pretty colors. So if you see these, grab them, because these would be good for stocking stuff for a teenager or for an adult or whatever. Mm -hmm. Really, really, really nice. Sorry, my mom was texting me. So I got those. Excited about that. And then I found three new mascaras from the same line, which I'm going to save for Elizabeth. And this is what they look like. And so the pink one, this is, they are all in black. And it says, not tested on animals, which is amazing, cruelty-free, by Beauty Intuition. This The pink one is Big Bold Lashes Mascara, smudge-proof, rich color, instant volume. I'm not going to open them up because they're for Elizabeth. Oh, excuse me. And she might not want to use them right away. But this is what the brush looks like. And, um, yeah, it says... Apply two coats of mascara to the upper lower lash without letting the first coat dry to avoid clumping. Good to know. So, and I love the packaging of it. Absolutely beautiful. So that's the pink one. And then this orange one is um, plump, big plump mm -hmm. lashes. So this one's big bold lashes. The orange is big plump lashes. 
Rich Color Instant Plump and Curl. And that's what the brush looks like. So, at first when I saw these, I thought the color of the mascara was the color of the bottle, but no, they're all black. And then the purple one is Big Long Lashes, Rich Color, Instant Length. So all the brushes look the same to me of what they look like. Uh, but I thought that was a pretty good deal for $1.25 to try out some new mascara. Yeah, so these are going to be for Elizabeth. But again, I'm not going to open them up because she might not want to use them right away. So that is for Bex. Her stuff is going to go in here. Okay. Next, I found these by Be Pure. This is the nail polish remover pen infused with vitamin E. And it is a 0.14 fluid ounce for milliliters. I got two of them, one for me and one for Elizabeth. So I'll open up mine and I'm going to put Elizabeth in her bag. I mean, a nail polish pen remover, that's pretty cool. So if you make a mistake or something, you just use this to uh, fix your mistake. So let's see. All right, so that's what it looks like. It looks like a marker. So I'm assuming when you're painting your nails, you can easily just do this and it takes the nail polish off. So that's pretty cool. And yeah, it is manufactured by Four Star Group. So I don't know, Be Pure, is that considered, is that a Dollar Tree brand, the Be Pure? Because it says it's from Forrester Group, not Greenbrier. So comment down below if you know if that is, um, Dollar Tree brand or not. Okay. Next, I found some um, by Beauty Intuition. These are Get Ready to Shine Lip Glosses. And I thought these were pretty cool. And so we're going to swatch these. So the first one is Hot Pink. Uh, rich and intense color, smooth application, moisturizes and hydrates. I mean, come on, look at the packaging. It kind of reminds you of like, um, like Maybelline almost. That's what it reminds me of, of Maybelline. So let's open this up. Here's what it looks like. This is the applicator. So let's swatch it. Oh yeah, that is definitely hot pink. That is gorgeous. Perfect for the summertime. I'm pretty sure Elizabeth won't want this one, so I'll probably keep it. So this is the hot pink one. And I mean, look at the, the detailing of it. Like lip gloss, the word lip gloss is engraved in the bottle. In like the tube. That's really nice. Okay, so the next one is red velvet. Um, moisturizes and hydrates. She might want to use this one for dance. And again, same packaging. Ooh, let's see. That's bright. These are very bold color lip glosses. That's for sure. That is the red one. It looks more like an orangey red to me, in my opinion, like an orangey red. That looks really, really pretty. I am so happy that I found these. And then this one is Mocha, which is probably going to be for me, the Mocha one. Again, same packaging. Oh, that one's dark. And it smells like coffee, like a chocolatey coffee. Yep, it has the scent. There you go. There's the brown one, the mocha. That looks really pretty. These are very vibrant colors. If you see these, grab them because that is an amazing deal. I wonder if these have scents too. Let's see. 
You know what? This one smells kind of like bubble gum, in my opinion. And the red one kind of like bubble gum as well. But the brown one smells more like a chocolatey scent. So if you see these, grab them because that is an amazing find by Beauty Intuition. And then lastly, I found by the same brand, Beauty Intuition, bold and bright lipsticks. And this is what they look like. So we're going to go through these. And I'm probably going to wear one of them today. So this is the rosy pink, rich color, smooth application, moisturizes and hydrates. Also um, cruelty free. And on the bottle or tube it says color. So let's see. Oh, this is a very soft light pink. This might not be my color. Yeah, that's a very soft, light pink. So I'll probably give that to Elizabeth. She might like that one. And it has a scent to it too. That one's really pretty. Okay. This one is Mocha. The brown. Uh, lighter than I expected it to be. There you go, right there. And it has that scent. Very pretty. I'll probably keep that one. And then Ruby Red. Ruby Red. Let's see how red this one is. She might keep this one too for dance. Ruby red. Oh no, I might keep that one. That one's really pretty. In fact, let's try it on. Let's see. It's hard doing it in the camera. That is really bold. I like that. I don't know if it matches my eye color, but you know what? Let's mix it with the brown. Let's see what it looks like with the brown. What? They're very smooth feeling. Like I got it out of the line, but it's okay. They're very, did I get it on my teeth? No, they're very smooth feeling. They feel nice on the lips. I do like these. So I'll probably keep these two, give this to Elizabeth and maybe Elizabeth wants these ones and then I keep these three. So I'll probably keep these three and she'll take these ones. Um, but yeah, we'll see. But those are amazing. I mean, look at the pigments on these. Amazing. For $1.25, you can't beat that. $1.25. If you see these, grab them. Even if you don't want them from yourself, you can give them away as gifts. Save them for, you know, Mother's Day. Save them for Mother's Day coming up next year. I'm pretty sure this will be good by then. So, yeah, and this color right here, that is a gorgeous color. All of them are gorgeous colors, for sure. But, yeah, so that is it for this haul. And I will have my second part, part the second part of my video up tomorrow for you guys. So if you enjoyed this quick Dollar Tree haul, uh, it's actually, I, it was a lot quicker than I expected. Um... If you enjoyed it, please get a thumbs up so I know. Uh, please consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, everyone.